Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, welcome, welcome back to the game here. Welcome to a Deep Silver game. I don't... Have I ever done a Deep Silver game? I... I don't actually know that answer. Um... I know I've played them, but... Now I'm gonna look this up while the loading begins. Using the Cry Engine, the Crowware, the something, the Sequence Mugen Engine. Our next project. I can't, I don't remember the symbol. Actually, I'll let the answer take us away. Charles IV, King of Bohemia and Holy Roman Emperor, had a long and successful reign. The empire he ruled from Prague expanded, and his subjects lived in peace and prosperity. When the Emperor died, the whole Empire mourned. More than 7,000 people accompanied him on his last procession. The heir to the throne of the flourishing Empire was Charles' son, Wenceslas IV, whose father had prepared him for this moment all his life. But Wenceslas did not take after his father. He neglected affairs of state for more frivolous pursuits. He even failed to turn up for his own coronation as emperor, which did little to endear him to the Pope. Wenceslas the Idol did not impress the imperial nobility either. His difficulties mounted until the nobles, exasperated by the inaction of their ruler, turned for help to his half-brother, King Sigismund of Hungary. Sigismund decided on a radical solution. He kidnapped the king to force him to abdicate, then took advantage of the ensuing disorder to gain greater power for himself. He invaded Bohemia with a massive army and began pillaging the territories of the king's outlets. It is here that my story begins. And who am I? Oh, well, you know who I am. Uh, back to Deep Silver. As a publisher, we have done a couple of games for him. Uh, what DLCs do I have? I do not have... I have this tournament. Okay. I'm not sure if I'll do DLC yet. If you guys want DLC, of course, let me know. But what's first? Uh, English, English. I'm going to do English. I, I didn't do any changes, so you sure. Um, normal way of playing hardcore in this game. War horse. Um, games that we've done published by them. We did touch Dead Island at one point. The Emperor 50 Sigil was a type of turmoil of the Holy Roman Empire, which is forced under the Emperor of Charles IV. But now, with his son, Wegley, the idol of the Bohemian throne, has fallen into disarray. The king's activity and ang angered many of the nobility, as well as half brother King Sigismund of Hungary, and decided to take desert steps in the empire. Holy cow, that I couldn't say that fast enough. It was how I did Catherine for a little bit. That dropped that. We did do Catherine a little bit. They did publish. Uh, Metro, and they did do uh, Frost Center Pro. So they actually did have a couple of games I did play. So we actually have done quite a few. This game was actually released last year. Well, as we need to have the recording, this is December 30th, so you guys will actually see this probably until halfway through 2020. Not halfway. First part of January. That guy looks important. 
he's got friends. I like friends. That makes me sad. Bussing little villains. Bless. Same to you. Today's a scorch. <laughs> Be of little countryside home. Well, husband, how goes it? Good. I should get it finished today. Where on earth is Henry? I need him to run some errands. He was still sleeping when I went out. At this hour? Blue blooded idler. Well, it looks like he was out all evening, drinking like a lord. <laughs> Go and get the lazy bones up then. <laughs> Quick clout round the ear should do it. Mm -hmm. Henry, get up now. There's work to be done. Get up or I'll come get you up, you slug of bed. Hear that? You'd better not vex him. Now get up quick. Your breakfast is on the table. Wait, what's this? Have you been... Oh, Henry. How many times have I told you about fighting? Oh, it's nothing. It's just a scratch. You've been at that sword play again, haven't you? You'd better pray your father doesn't get to hear of it. You know how he feels about it. Now don't worry, it wasn't that. I, I just scratched myself is all. Hmm. Well, just don't come crying to me if you really do get hurt. The sound now of life get can't up, sword fight? Okay. That makes zero mm. sense. Little oh. main character, Henry. <laughs> he's a, uh, he's a something, all right. I told you I want to do a game that's a mixed difficulty between Skyrim and Dark Souls. Yeah, I feel like this is the best game for it. Straight realism. Okay, 14th century religion sewn in there too. Or 15th century religion. I keep forgetting centuries are weird. They're always the one that you don't expect it to be. Um, game? A fine state you're in this morning. What on earth did you get up to last night? So, what's cool is you get to choose with what how you want to build your characters. Your, kind of your character creation. Um, in this case, it won't help. So I'm with Bianca. I was with Bianca. We were um, talking. Talking, were you? That's what you call it, is it? So the kids are calling it. Stop it, Ma. Well, I've got a feeling there's something you're not telling me. And it's connected with that scratch on your hand. And that suspicious looking character with a sword who turned up in town recently. So I'm learning to sword fight. And what of it? What harm does it do? At least I'll be able to defend myself. God above, Hal. You know how your father will react when he finds out. How? What's he going to do? I'm doing nothing wrong. I just wanted to try it. On your own head be it then. I can't stop you, and you can deal with your father on your own. Don't come looking to me for help. Did Matthew and Fritz come looking for me? No, I haven't seen them this morning. They shouldn't be hard to find. They'll be hanging around a tavern somewhere, as usual. Oh, not this again. Leave it lie, mother. Like I said, it's a traditional RPG. You can do a lot of different stuff, but... Oh, I forgot how awkward the controls are in this game. Uh, 
Controls are a little bit awkward in this game, but once... Yay, apples! No, don't sit. Let's move. No! Dang it. Alright. Let's get up. So what's cool in this game is it's very... Kind of real life a little bit. A lot of it. What am I talking about? Wow, was I really crouched just now? <laughs> Come here. Dad. At least you're up. That's a start. Anyway, we've a lot of work to do today. I'm finishing the sword for Sir Radzik, and I need your help. With what? I'm running out of charcoal. Run to the market and buy a bag from the charcoal burner. I'll need some money then. Yeah, that's the other thing. Kunesh still owes me for an axe, a hammer, and the nails I sold him a month ago. Not to mention his debt from before. Go and tell him to pay up, at least for the axe and hammer, and then use the money to buy the charcoal. Kunesh? That drunkard? <laughs> That'll be fun. Well, you're a big lad now. I'm sure you can manage. If not, tell him that next time I'll come myself and personally use that hammer to bang those nails into his arse. Sure I'll be happy to hear it. Is that all? Not quite. The Chamberlain at the castle has the cross guard for Sir Radzik's sword, which I had engraved in Sasal. You want me to go and pick it up? All right. Money, charcoal, cross guard. Got it. And ale. <laughs> Stop off at the tavern on your way home. I know you'll be going there anyway to see that girl of yours. But make sure the ale's still cool from the cellar when you get back. Her name is Bianca. Right, so make sure Bianca draws me a nice cool one. Run along now, work won't wait. Alright, we have plenty of objectives to do, so... Yeah. Buy a bag of charcoal, collect the debt from Kunish, pick up the cross guard, and buy ale at the tavern. Plus, we need a sword fight. So the first thing we do is we want to go talk to these guys, fine gentlemen up here. Got me with you. I'm with you, Henry. How are you? Father sent me. We're forging a sword for Sir Radzik, and the Chamberlain has the cross guard and pommel. Father had them engraved in Sasal. Right. They're here. The Chamberlain gave them to us for you. We looked them over. Beautiful work. I've never seen anything so fine. I can't wait to see the sword. Just make sure you don't botch it. Mm. Did I ever botch anything? <sighs> Where shall I start? Ah, shut up and give me what I want, or I'll kick your ass this evening. Right away, your lordship. <laughs> he learned tools. Magnificent. Shame I can't keep the sword for myself. Well, I'd better go if we're to get the job done by this evening. Godspeed. See you later in the tavern. I certainly will. After today's work, the ale might even be on me. Let's go visit Kanesh. This is, like I said. That's how you run? Okay, I played the game mainly on PC version, and that's why I went to the, the uh, Xbox version. I feel like I have better odds recording it. I need that axe. God be with you, Kanesh. What do you want? My father sent me to get the coin you owe him for the axe, hammer, and nails. I've got nothing. Clear off. Oh. You know you owe father for a lot more than just the axe and hammer. If he went to the bailiff about it, you'd be in deep water. At least pay for the tools if you can't pay for everything. I told you I have no coin, you bastard. Get the hell out of here, or I'll use the axe on you. 
Persuasion. There are many ways to do it. Skills, money, look threatening, like people, use speech. Okay. And then your reputation has to be higher to win. Uh, I must have misheard you. It sounded like you just told me to clear off. But you wouldn't be stupid enough to think you can steal, not pay your debts, and then try to scare me. Would you? You son of a whore. How dare you speak to me like that? Didn't your thieving father teach you any manners? No? Well, I'll teach you then. Sure. Oh, if he wants to fight. Alright, hand to hand. It is the basis of all combat. So, right trigger, basic hook, right button jab, left trigger kick. Block is a weird button. Jesus! You're going to... So what about hand-to-hand -hand fighting in this game? You want to make sure your stamina stays up. Because that's what's going to... What did it cost? All right, blacksmith boy, you got the better of me. Take what you want, but you haven't heard the last of this. We'll fight later. Well, we got one part done. Charcoal man, how we doing? God be with you. And to you. Let's talk trade. I don't know what should. Our color creep is ten. And then you can haggle, cause why not? I'd like to discuss the price. 
Why not? I'm bloody. Holy cow, I'm bloody. Alright, so haggling works both ways. You can buy more cheap or sell deer. What about this? That sounds pretty interesting. A little less, and I'll be satisfied. Then we'll do one. I knew we'd come to an arrangement. Successful Hagrid. Okay, it is ten. Bianca is an option, but... Do you want to learn something? I hey, know. Who I'm looking for? Have you recovered from yesterday's great wound? Oh, it was nothing. Except Mother noticed and had a word or two to say about it. No mother's happy when a son starts to take an interest in swords. Where there's weapons, there's death. The question is, what do you want? I don't want to rot in this hole forever. I feel like I don't belong here. I want to live and see the world. But the world's a dangerous place and I need to know how to protect myself. Spoken like a man. And as it happens, today's your last chance. I have to leave. So, are you ready to get stuck in? Sure, sure. Yes. All right, I wait on the ground by the sheepfold as usual. All right, because Bianca isn't that important, we have to do Bianca's last. <laughs> we'll go ahead and meet him up here. This is the map. You press up on the directional pad. This is the country. I need to level up. How do I level up? Alright, so we get to have perks. Uh. Scout because that's gonna be important late game, you'll understand. Alright, we have a point of strength. We can carry dead or conscious body, or we can block a point of strength if you're still. Well, of course, we're gonna go to that because we wanna be a tank. And I don't think I can do anything else with mode, correct? No, I cannot. That's fine. <laughs> Actually, next time we'll Kingdom Come Deliverance. Let's get combat trained. I'll see you then.